Hello everyone, my name is Rahul and welcome to my channel Rahul QA Labs. Uh, so in today's tutorial, uh, we uh, will be seeing uh, an introduction to Jenkins. So uh, what is Jenkins and what are the features of Jenkins? Uh, so let's start and um, okay, so uh, before uh, starting uh, and moving on to what is Jenkins, uh, let us first understand the concept of uh, CI CD. So, uh, CI CD uh, is nothing but it stands for uh, continuous integration and continuous uh, development, and it is the set of processes which enables the frequent changes in the code for software development in a reliable manner. Okay, so uh, if I talk about continuous integration, so it is uh, a development practice where the developers uh, commit the changes to the source code and uh, that is done at regular intervals in the shared uh, repository. Okay, so uh, it is a part of DevOps and uh, it helps in shortening uh, the uh, development lifecycle process. Uh, so the release updates uh, can be provided in a sustainable uh, manner and uh, as I said the multiple developers can make changes which is then finally combined into a single base or uh, you know a single final branch uh, for example uh, you know where the code is maintained like github etc okay so uh, the automated tools like Jenkins bamboo uh, they build the new code uh, for integration and uh, so CI/CD uh, practice allows and helps to find uh, the bugs early, and the quality of the software is improved. So uh, this is uh, like uh, basic uh, about uh, CI/CD. So let's see uh, what is Jenkins and uh, what are the features of Jenkins in the next slide. Uh, okay, so the very first point says uh, so Jenkins is a popular integration tool uh, which helps the teams to automate their deployments. Uh, the monitoring is done by the tool for different uh, execution cycles. Okay, so uh, Jenkins is an open source automation tool which is uh, written in Java. It is a Java based tool, so it requires JRE for operation. So JRE is nothing but your Java runtime environment. Uh, so it allows for uh, continuous integration and uh, it builds and tests the software projects Okay, and it supports a lot of plugins which helps to integrate with different tools uh, You can automate your builds and uh, test them on different operating systems uh, like Windows uh, Mac OS Linux etc and uh, Jenkins quick build ability and testing helps to provide early results so that you can check that if your code is uh, ready to go into production or not okay so these are some important points uh, about what is Jenkins now uh, let's go and move to our next slide where we will see some features of Jenkins Uh, okay, so the very first uh, feature is it is an open source tool uh, which provides the continuous integration services for the software development Next point is uh, it can be easily installed on different operating systems like Mac OS Linux uh, Windows etc and uh, It is easily extensible as it provides the different plugins support. So uh, I think it's it provides support for 600 uh, plus uh, plugins uh, it is simple to use and it has a user-friendly interface uh, it provides the notifications related to your builds so after your builds uh, are executed so their uh, uh, the passing or the failure or uh, the different notifications uh, is provided by Jenkins uh, you can view the test results uh, in the GUI format uh, next point is it provides the master slave architecture so uh, this helps uh, you to uh, build in a distributed environment uh, which helps you to reduce the load um, on the server okay so uh, Jenkins slaves are generally required to provide the desired environment and it works on the basis of request received from Jenkins master so uh, it is based on the master slave architecture uh, next point is we can easily configure the environments and uh, set it up 
and it supports the job models like freestyle pipeline etc that we will uh, discuss in our later slides where we will uh, try to create a freestyle or a pipeline and we'll try to execute the jobs and the last point is uh, it supports various version control systems and uh, notifications uh, okay so uh, this is uh, like a basic uh, uh, introduction to Jenkins and uh, CI CD uh, I hope you all uh, understood uh, the points mentioned out here if you have any doubts just put out a comment and uh, uh, I'll be uh, happy to help you so in the next uh, video we will see how uh, we can install Jenkins uh, on uh, Windows okay so uh, till then uh, keep learning in life thank you bye bye and take care